poetry as a practice. <laughs> yeah, this is yeah, this is very much a practice. Um, yeah, and it, it started. I mean, this this particular project for me was about turning poetry into a project or uh, poetry into a practice. Because um, I've always written poetry, and this Jan, you know, kind of last December, uh, I was in not a great place. I felt uh, I had I was dealing with some depression. I was dealing with uh, feeling kind of overwhelmed with work and a lot of stuff that was going on in my life. And uh, I was inspired by a few different books and some other artists that I'm friends with who had done projects that were about ongoing. And I got really interested in the idea of habits and rituals and uh, practice, really. Um, and so in January, I got invited to be part of a, an event in Austin. It was called the Feast of Fools. And it was put together by a couple artists uh, in East Austin. And I set up this typewriter and wrote poems for people. And I had no idea that I was going to do a big project, but it all sort of came together and crystallized in that moment. And I really, because I got into this flow state and everything just came together. And I realized, like, I'm good at this and I really like this. And, uh, and I want to do more of it. And I had been reading this, this other book uh, called The Happiness of Pursuit uh, by this guy, Chris uh, Guillebeau. I'm probably saying his name wrong, but he's out of Portland. He runs uh, uh, the World Domination Summit, which is a great summit for anybody who's watching these kinds of videos. Uh, it's about turning your passion into what you do day to day. Um, and so in his book, he talks about, you know, setting, uh, framing what you want to do uh, as a quest, and then that is a way to give it meaning yeah. on an ongoing basis. And that really hit me. And he also says, you know, giving something numbers uh, can help to sort of frame it. So a thousand seemed like a lot of poems, <laughs> yeah. but also something that uh, I could do if I was willing to change, you know, sort of what I did and uh, really if I went after it, I could do it and it would, and it, but it would be hard. Uh, so, and so that's what I went for. 